Okay guys, PJ back again with another Fallout 76 video. This time I'm launching a nuke on PlayStation. I'm going to time how long it takes to do a solo normal, and I do stress that, normal run. Okay, if the doors are open. There we go. Now, I've actually started this already and the console blue screened and the game crashed. So yeah, my first start didn't go too well but anyway we're not going to miss anything we're pretty much going to kill everything that's the way I normally do these we're running a bloodied shotgun combat shotgun and we've got most of the shotgun and perk cards so the shotgun on my current health is putting out let's have a look 197 damage without any you know psychos or low health or anything like that okay first things first well, let's get out of the room is the first things first. And let the game catch up, because it's not actually telling me where to go, which is pretty useful. Okay, so... Yeah, you meant to t tell me way past the laser grids. I know this, but you meant to show me a marker. There we go. Marker, please. <laughs> Need all this to work, guys. You know, if anyone's watching this and they've never done a nuke, you do need the game to work properly. Now, you can hack the terminal back there in the other room and make the uh, targeting of the uh, turrets basically target anything so they can target the robots, which is really handy, and then the robots shoot back. So, we're going to go security protocol there. Find a way past, you need a biometric ID card, etc. So turret control, here we go. Let's just do this. Remove targeting restrictions. Okay. Now we've got to make a biometric ID card. There's a couple of stages to this. It's really quick though, to be honest. Could go and kill those up there. Can I be bothered? Nah, do it in a minute. So if we log on. No, said log on. Oh, we're glitchy. Okay, there we go. I'm actually doing this on a private server so that uh, we don't get too many glitches. So, yeah, hopefully we can get through this quickly. Now we're going to go over here. Just looking for the robots. I think there's a turret nearby as well. Hi. Hi. Yeah, you got to talk to the robots, guys. Okay, find an old biometric ID card and acquire your biometric data. So what we're going to do is plonk the power armor here in the entrance, so nothing can get past it. Good tip if you're a you know fairly low level, clamber into the chamber. There we go. Now I did tell you that the game crashed the first time I did this. I got this far, I'd already picked up a biometric ID card, an old one. It was on one of the beds. So that's why it's not asked me to get it this time. But I will show you what one looks like because it will tell you to get one. Okay, find an old biometric ID card. Oh, now it's caught up. Now we're getting somewhere. Okay, so where are we? Get my bearings, guys. Might be one in here. Normally the barracks room has them. What was that? Oh, I hate these. These rip for your armour. Go away. Health should go back up running this perk card. No. Okay. There we go. There's a biometric ID card. The blue thing. Take found one of those now we go erase the card why is my health not going back up that's annoying stint back okay round we go really more of you these guys just keep coming until you kill the captain one and then the stop but generally just shoot them all it's all XP and seeing as we're doing the legendary run nowadays, you want as much XP as you can get. So raise the card using the card slot thing here. 
that's the one you've just picked up there we go create biometric ID so we go to the terminal and fabricate an ID card there we go uses the old blue card erases it and puts the new data that you've scanned yourself with onto that card now we can get past the first laser grid okay let's go around into here oh, hello I can hear a gutsy oh here he is hello chap go away oh we got another one Right, swipe the card, and hey presto, there you go, you can now get through no problem, which is nice. Okay, let's go. That's basically your first bit to get through. Mm, hi, another one. Now the robots do get harder, you're going to get assaultrons, you're going to get sentry bots, etc. First assaultron is coming up, and if you've got a ton of psycho, which I haven't, I suggest you might want to pop one of those if you're a lowish level. Yeah, I heard you. Hi. I'll uh, we'll just wait for him to be live. Really? Can't that's this thing, it's really annoying. Come on, die. Thank you. Okay, he's down. Let's carry on. These shotguns are very good if you can vats and shoot. They're not too good when you can't get a vats lock. That was slow. You should have kicked in ages ago. There we go. Health going back up as I would expect it to. Hi guys. Shall we kill them? Yeah, we've got to kill them, really. We can't hide. We're not stealth. You can do this in full stealth armour and not really bother with anything. But that's boring. We want to shoot stuff. Okay, so we are currently on eight minutes, for those interested. Yeah, we have just gone round in a circle, but I'd like to clear the robots out before carrying on, to be honest. Okay bit of radiation there in we go by gutsy head for control room yeah let's do that find a way to secure the reactor look who's in there brilliant another assault drum there is a timed bit in here and it is a bit of a rush so be warned. Hi. That was quicker because we could that's it. Really? Thank you. I normally take all the robots and all the turrets out before I start doing absolutely anything in here. Oh, reload? Really? Thank you. So you've got a load of leaky pipes in here. And basically you've got to fix them all. Up we go. Let's kill all the turrets. Lot of turrets. Yeah, 
Yeah, yeah. We see you. Nearly there, guys. Really good place to pick up fusion ammo. If you use a laser gun, uh, this is the place to pick up fusion ammo. You can normally scoop up more than you'd spend, you know, if you do use one of those. So, uh, yeah, good place for that. And also picking up lead, because in the workout areas, the gym areas, there's a lot of lead weights, uh, lifting weights, and you want to pick those up, really. Okay, let's go. And this bit's a rush, especially solo, if you're going to do the auxiliary thing, which I normally try and do. Need that to hurry up. Gotta go. Gotta go! Go away. Busy. So there's absolutely tons of these pipes to repair, and you've got to do them quick. Normally I manage it solo, but just warning you, it can be a bit of a rush. Just follow it round methodically, and then listen very carefully. It helps if you own a headset for this bit, because you can sort of get a direction as to where they are. So, oh, hi. Go away, busy. One over here. Above my head. Yep, there we go. Come on, click. Thank you. Let's go over here. Can hear it, can't see it. There it is. Now, if you look at my time, you'll see what I mean about being in a rush. Let's kill this robot. He's going to annoy me. Shush! Here we go, here we go, here we go. Here's the pipe. The last couple are a nightmare to find. Sometimes they don't put markers up, sometimes they do. Last one, last one, where's the last one? There it is. Okay, whoop, stuck on the reactor, don't want to do that. Let's go. Back to the control room. Restart reactor. Job done. That's your next section complete. Just quickly, uh, oh, I don't know. Got somebody else shooting at me, have I? Just going to kill this dude. And then I think I'll do a rad away. Although I'm running a bloodied shotgun, I'm not really a bloodied build, if I'm truthful. I prefer having lots and lots of health. Where's the other one? There he is. Let's go and get him. Right, where were we? Radaway. Radex. Psycho. So where's the last one? I can never remember because I run that different, many different characters. Okay, let's go. Next section. Main thing for me is just to be methodical, take your time. Don't miss anything. Some people rush through them. I tend to not do that. Yes, I do reload an awful lot. I like to have a full clip. So we are currently on 14 minutes, 36 seconds. No, no Sultron hiding. Sometimes I've had them spawn in really weird areas. No, not there. Turret up there. Right, now we've got to break these by clicking destroy or shooting them. You can do either, really. I'll save my bullets. At this point, you're possibly halfway through. It normally takes me about half an hour. 
you can do it quicker if you rush of course you can hack that for the turret control but we won't be doing that today there's a lot of these to do an awful lot that all of them yeah there's the door down so we can get in hi robot hi turret When running a VATS shotgun build like I am doing, I walk everywhere to keep my AP high because obviously running uses your AP and I want that for, for VATS in, especially while the perk card is currently up the creek that helps you out with all that sort of thing. Bethesda know it's a bug. They know there's a problem. Thanks, Turret. She's shooting all these for me. That's really handy. Really handy of them, that is. Oh, hi. <laughs> Let's get the Assaultron instead, eh? Goodbye. <laughs> okay, let's go. More security. How much more security do we need? Did we get them all? I think we did. Yeah, looks good. Doors down. Did we miss anything? Yeah, we could do these. You can miss a few. There's too many of them, so don't worry if you don't get some of these. There's more in the main room. I love standing in front of them and just letting their own lasers destroy them, it's great. Yeah, okay, let's take this turret out, it's starting to get annoying. The difference is quite amazing. I did this in T65 armor earlier today, and I was taking no damage, it, well, nearly no damage, it's hilarious shows you how bad Ultrasight really is compared to the new stuff. Really? Oh, I didn't see you. <laughs> no wonder we were taking a lot of damage. Okay, it's quiet now. Uh, we're nearly there. I think we've killed everything. Have you got anything good? Fusion cells, is that it? Can't pick too much up, guys, because um, no calibrated shocks on this ultrasite. There's your missile, your first view. Now, there's a website called Nuka Crypt. And if you search Nuke Crypt on Google, they always have all the Nuke codes ready to go. So you just go on their website and it will give you the full Nuke code so you can launch your Nuke without doing all the decrypting and the collecting the pieces. Literally no one does that. Everybody uses the site or, you know, a similar site. It's just not worth the hassle. Come on, mainframe, hurry up. Board now. Nearly there. Desk van. You know I always collect desk vans if you look at any of my other videos. They have a screw in them. Screws are rare. I have tried this before on PlayStation. And I don't mean the time a minute ago when it crashed. I mean genuinely before. And, uh, oh look, another Assaultron. Fantastic. Hmm. Thank you. Um, yeah, I had a proper go at it when I was level 90-something. And uh, some really kind people in Stealth Armour basically came in and nicked the nuke. So uh, that was hilarious. So you got to watch that, guys. There are some scummy people out there. 
Oh, not another one. Can you please go away? I need you to wake up. No. Where are you? Ah, now I can get you. No, you died. Thank you. Right, here we go. How much more have we got? Maybe this panel will do it. So we're currently on 20 minutes. Like I say, I have got a big stopwatch at the side of me. Not taking any shortcuts, so yeah. Got some over here. Oh no, we've done it. Brilliant. Thought it was showing a little bit more to do, but it isn't. Let's go. Down the stairs. More bad guys. So that's the mainframe section done. Up into the control room after this next corridor. Now the control room, I always do that, I was going around the stairs the wrong way. <laughs> the control room is the basically main launch area. Uh, you got to protect a load of robots. Now this room's easy. The next room, if you're not kitted up well enough, look who's in here. Yeah, this is a sentry bot. And there's an Assaultron just for good measure. Oh, we missed one, guys. Say hello to all the nice robots. As soon as you go around the corner, he activates. Could do with the assault trunk coming out, really. Gotta watch that. So you'll be concentrating on the sentry bot to the right as you walk through the door. That thing will come and uh, start shooting the hell out of you. You, come over here. Mm. And that's how we deal with him. Get rid of the turret. Boom. That always happens, I always forget. Okay, let's go and get the Assaultron. Or we'll get the Robo Brain first, whichever. This is the door you're trying to get through. Basically, you're going to have to replace all these panels. Now, there is still an Assaultron in here, and a few other bits and bobs. You can find these lying around the room, the new replacements, or you can craft them. Crafting them is quicker, but of course you've got to get out your power armour. I will show you where you craft them. Oh, let's just uh, quickly log on if I've got time. Come on, hurry up. Yeah, let's go. So there's one new one here, look. You pick that up. Stick it in. There we go. One out of 15 done. Oh, look, here we go. Here's our friend. Come on. Thank you. So, if you're crafting them, there's a workbench basically to craft the map, but they are lying around. I will prove that by finding you one before we go and craft a load. Ooh, there's a desk fan. I like my desk fans. So, oh, there's one hiding a lot. So you can find all 15, it's not a problem. But it is way, 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 way faster to just craft them. Tinker workbench, basically. I'm gonna look around for some spare ones. No, can't find any. Okay, I can hear a robot though. Hmm. Where's the robot? I can hear the robot. Are you in here? You are in here. Cool. The 
the robots normally come in this door so if you are going to craft them stick your power armor here oh great <laughs> I forgot a turret what do you know come on quickly this is the bit where it's like, wheel up game, please hurry up. So we go down to quest. And we go mainframe core. And there we go. We just click, make loads of them. You can pre-build these at your own uh, crafting bench and bring them with you. But be warned, they weigh 1.5 each. So you're probably going to be overweight building them. And if you get out of the silo at the end and you're overweight, it's probably because you've picked a load or pan crafted a load and basically got yourself too heavy. So make sure you drop them. There's the turret I missed. Thank you. Okay, shall we go back? I'm heavy. Hmm, we wonder why. die. See the bouncy health on that? It hits the bottom and goes straight back up again. Crazy. Whoa, we don't need to craft any, we need to replace them. But I can hear a robot somewhere. Let's ignore it. Let's get lighter again. One, or well, two, we've already done two. Three, Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, and fifteen. Oh, look, drink time. Super. Yeah, always bring loads of food with you when you go into these places. You do not really want to be doing this. Did I bring any purified water? Yes, I did. Super. As soon as you do this, it'll take away the security measures. So you can just walk through. Open the door. 27 minutes. And like I say, I'm not rushing. This is a takey time run. And there's your missile. Dum -dum -dum. Like I say, we're well on our way now to the control room. Up we go. Basically, you're about to enter the room where you put your nuclear keycard, which you will have gone and got before coming in here, hopefully. Oh, hello. There we go. Oh, yeah, you got to see the teddy bear, guys. Check that out. Teddy bear with a gun. Sorry. So that was cool. Moving on. This is the control room. Yes, it's full of bad guys. Yes, it's got us Ultrons in it. That's where you launch. So there's a missile there. Look, a nice big missile. Mm, you really should concentrate on other things, but still. Let's go and kill these uh, turrets off. Not with a shotgun, no way, can't reach. Let's go and get the robots first. Fun times. Hi. Reloading is so annoying at the wrong time. <laughs> okay, let's carry on. You got to make sure this room's completely empty, because some basically some robots come in and they are to prepare the launch of your missile, and you've got to make them safe and secure. Oh, we got another assault drum. Reloading. Oh, man. Is there 
another turret. Should be one over here. Yeah. <laughs> there you go. Score rank. Good for XP. Initiate launch prep. Two computers. Take your pick. We'll go with this one. Sorry, one computer in this section. Just made an error. Quick drink while I do this. Initiate launch prep. Now you got all you got to do literally is protect some dudes uh, while they sort it all out, and um, you're good to go. You're good to launch after that. So we're on 31 minutes. I said about half an hour. We're not far out. Probably five minutes of this section. So these are good guys. We don't shoot these dudes. These man all the terminals that are everywhere. Oh thanks. I love some shotgun shells. Used enough of them. So you got to look after these guys, you can't let them get killed. So all the robots normally, for me, the bulk of them come from the left. Oh, did I miss one? Really? Got to get that. That was shoddy. Never miss any, because they'll destroy your little robot dudes. Okay, what we got over there? Is that a turret? That's a turret. I've missed a couple, guys. This is really shoddy. So if you're watching this live and you've done nukes before, you'll be thinking, what's going on? Next. There you go, there's the second robot on his way. You have five in total. Oh, three robots in total. Must have missed one. We'll just stim pack up, I think. Did I hear somebody shoot at something? Let's make sure this dude's okay. Yeah, he's okay. Oh, he's in here. I can hear him getting shot at. No, 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 leave him alone. I said leave him alone. <laughs> He's okay, he's not took that much damage. They're very slow. Look how fast he's walking. It's like, come on, hurry up. Oh, we got an Assaultron. Where's the Assaultron? No, do not want you shooting my dude. This bit is quite tricky solo when there's five of them to look after. Where's that assault tron? That's five. We've got five to look after. So we've got one up there, one at the front, and then they're all at these desks. Oh, hey up. And they don't really go for you. They do go for uh, Mr. Turret. Poor show, I missed a turret. Go away. Did I miss a turret in here? Mm. Can't see one. So one, two, three, four, five, we've got all of them. If you get one blown up, don't worry, another one will appear, but it takes even longer to get this section done. Right, where was shooting? I heard shooting. There we go. Oh, hello. That's it. You come and attack me and leave my robots alone. You do not want it shooting your robots. It's much better that it attacks you. Ah, oh, more of them. Leave them alone. Doing this on a double XP weekend is the best. You're going to do really well out of it. You do really well out of it anyway. And um, we'll just quickly pull up Nuka Crypt in a second when we're done. 
Always bring a spare nuclear key card. Don't come with one. Bring two is my advice, just in case it glitches or something like that. What's going on? Oh, that's bad. We don't want that happening. Ah, there you are. Ah, here we go. Here we go. What's going on? Left. Another assault tram. Prep done. Boom! All robots die straight away. You are good to go at this point. So, we go to the control point. That's 35 minutes, guys, and we are now ready to launch the nuke. So, let's go on nuke crypt. Get our nuclear code. Uh, nuke crypts for this week. Okay, we're in Charlie. So, first things first, let's swipe our card. Let's punch our keypad in. So we got 868. Six, eight, uh, one, five, three, nine, nine. What? One, five, three. And there we go. That is how you launch a nuke and get your trophy. Like I say, 35 minutes. Not bad. You can do it a lot quicker. You can do it sort of 15 minutes if you speed run it or you stealth it. But if you're going to kill everything, yeah, that's the way to do it. Then we can watch our nuclear missile, which is this dude here, go. Boom. Thanks for the assassins, legendary. Wow. Now you can target anywhere, but I uh, decided to do the queen for the hell of it. And that's it. Guys, thanks a lot for watching. Catch you again on the next one. Bye.